Hi everybody, this is Mirav and today we're going to talk about the subscription plans manager of Guru. Well, if you go to subscriptions and then plans, you will see that there are a few plans by default and that's just to make your life easier. But if you want to edit or add new plans, you can do that easily. If you want to edit the plan, just click on it. If you want to add a plan, just click new. Let's, let's start by adding a new plan. So you basically want to know what the terms of the plan are. For example, one month membership. And then you can choose the terms. Unlimited means it never expires. This course will be for them available forever and ever. So let's say you want to do a one month plan. You choose the number one and then you choose a month. And then you click save and you're done. It will be shown here on top and whatever changes you want to make just open it and make the changes. Now you can also decide if you want this uh, plan to be published or not. You can also order and reorder those plans so that they will show it the way you want them on the front end. Now once you order those plans they are available for you to add to a course. So if we go to courses under training and we'll open one of the courses, remember you have to open it under edit info and not under course tree. You click edit. You can see that under pricing and plans tab, you have the ability to choose which of the plans you've created are available for this course by checking the box next to the plan name. You can also see the terms and you can set the price for each plan. You can also choose which plan is going to be the default plan that's available on the front end. Now once people uh, finish their uh, membership, let's say it's expired, they will be prompted to uh, resubscribe and here you can offer them the ability to uh, have maybe a discount by uh, creating renewal plans. And in this case, you can choose which plans you want to have available as renewal plans and which plan is, is uh, the default renewal plan and you can set the price here. So what does it mean on the front end? If somebody uh, bought a plan of let's say three months, when they go to my courses, they will see the name of the plan, the name of the course and how much time they have before it expires. Or if it already expired, it's going to show in, in uh, red and it's going to say this expired uh, this amount of days and hours ago. And then they can renew uh, the course. So this is it about plans of uh, Guru.